This is Barry Every with the National Underclassmen Combine, and we're here in Indianapolis, Indiana, where we just finished day three of the Midwest Ultimate 100, and I'm with O-Line MVP, Peter C Svianovich. Hopefully I said that okay. He's from Benedictine High School in Ohio. This offensive lineman has tremendous size. 6'5", 274, hey college coaches, he has a 25 and a half inch vert. That shows explosion and future athleticism. Hey, and Peter, your brother, he, what does your brother do, your older brother? Yeah, the older brother is the starting left tackle for the and what, Your older brother is the starting tackle for the University of Illinois, and what year is he in there? He's a redshirt sophomore. Redshirt sophomore. Well, I know this, you, you gotta be similar in size at the same point, am I correct? Yes. And uh, these are great numbers. Hey, I can tell you this. Went out there, as soon as I came over, he's easy to spot. He's got a great power base, very strong legs, and he has long arms. He has everything you want in an offensive tackle, especially a right offensive tackle. And he has the frame to add a lot more weight. Now, Peter, let me ask you this. Who does Benedictine circle on the schedule every year and they get excited about? Uh, that would have to be uh, Lake Catholic. Lake Catholic. We actually played them twice last year. We lost to them twice last year. Once in the regular season and once in the uh, first first round of finals and playoffs. And kind of, I'm kind of looking forward to the game because I'm kind of hoping that it kicks my ass. So, I mean, <laughs> hey, there's nothing wrong with that. It's football. Yeah. It's like chess, except you take chess pieces and you bash the other chess pieces. That's the way I, I describe football to people that don't know anything about it. Uh, let me ask you this. What do you think you need to work on? I know you've been to a lot of camps, and I know there's several Division I schools that are about to pull the trigger, it sounds like. But what do you think you need to work on to grab their attention and say, hey, my brother's at Illinois, we're similar type players, I can play in the Big Ten, or I can play at that level at least. What do you think you need to work on to let those coaches know, hey, I'm here? I would, uh, I would say I would work on my power, on my uh, upper body and up, so to say. I'd have to work on uh, just getting quicker better footwork um, other than that. I mean. Now last year during your, jur jur uh, during your junior season, how much did you weigh when you played offensive line? I weighed in at the end of the season at 232. 232 pounds. And now you're 274 and you're still growing, is that correct? Yes. So, I mean, that's something college coaches need to know. They watch this junior film. He's 30 pounds lighter in that film. Now he's, he's, he's starting to fill out and he looks the part. What did you enjoy about the Midwest Ultimate 100? I, uh, I like the coaches, the competition, and I was the only one that did beat number 63 on the defensive line. The defensive line so, I guess, I mean, I know, you did a great, he took an outside rush yeah. and you let him, you, you let him out to a pasture, right on by the quarterback. Hey Peter, congratulations. Hope to see you in Oklahoma, but if not, good luck this fall. Thank you.